Hello there again puzzle friends. We are here again with another video. I think you can imagine what this video will be about. Having in mind what the channel is, having in mind what I usually present. And without further ado, let's start this thing. A lot of paper. So we do the unpackaging. Let's put this aside. This uh, batch, should I say, I did order quite some time ago. Uh, hopefully this uh, shop um, offers uh, a part delivery, so to say, if you, they don't have all the puzzles that you uh, actually buy in one sitting, should I say. And this is the first ones came. The other ones will be quite some time. This become. This is only a, a small puzzle I bought for fun. I, we, as you know, as you, or as you may know, I do have something to do with education and so. This is one is called the <coughs> the teacher. So it's a classroom. Actually, it's probably for children. But why not? It was in a fair price, I think two euros or something. So I, I, sh I thought I would try it. Ah, this one. This one I found very nice. These are from New York. Yeah, New York Puzzle Company. I really like the imaging of this and the. Uh, I don't know how can I describe it. The way of painting. I don't know if it's from a specific art of school. I can ask, I know somebody who knows about this stuff, I can ask him what this picture actually is. Uh, New York, from New York I have done some puzzles. I was very, uh, how can I say, I was very happy with the quality. So I thought I will buy again, in New York again. Uh, this is one, one of the puzzles I would buy. Uh, it's called Shakespeare's, Shakespeare's Britain. Maybe they have names or places where Shakespeare has um, put on some plays or something. Here's some information about um, puzzle, uh, New York Puzzle Company. 1,000 pieces, the other one was 500 pieces. So now on to the next one, because this, there are some puzzles here, so it may take a while. Ah, this one I thought also it was very funny to make. Maybe a Halloween puzzle. I actually do have this uh, book. I believe it's 60 years old or something. The editions I have. I have not read it yet. But I will eventually. 1000 pieces again. 1000 pieces are a very good um, quantity of pieces, should I say. Because they are not so small so that the uh, puzzle will go very quick. And they are not so many so the puzzle will take too long to make this one is a 500 this is the same uh design so to say as the other one the same art uh, here is some dust from the packaging this one is called out of the woods i'm really made in the usa i'm really excited to make this one uh some more paper for the packaging. As I have already said in a previous video, this uh, shop, they do make a very good packaging. Ah, this one, this one I thought it was very funny. So I did buy it. New York. New York is a, actually a, a brand that is quite new to me. Uh, it's from the USA and in Europe. I don't know if there exists another shop that they, do, they have them, I'm not sure. Either way, 500 pieces, these are the different types of cheese i already know to whom i will dedicate this uh, you will see it uh, in the um, time lapse and do and do believe i will this one is a uh, one i will make i will be making quite soon let's see now another new york uh, you may think i put only new york because maybe they put all the new yorks together i don't know uh, some cacti, 
this looks somewhat different than what I thought, but either way I will check it again if it was the same one I, I did buy or I'm not sure. If they do have, ah, this one also looks nice, but this one I, don't, I have not seen it on the page. Either way, I will have to check this later if it's exactly what I bought. Either way, it's fun puzzle. Uh, uh, look this one with a lot of... I, I, I didn't remember I, I actually bought this one with a lot of mushrooms. I have, start, uh, I have studied in the um, university also uh, about plants and how uh, you can cultivate it, how you can protect them from their enemies, so to say, from diseases and stuff. And the mushrooms and the fungi was also the subject. And this also is this also one a small one, two hundred pieces. But you know, I do. I am. I really like uh, maps. And I I saw this. It was quite illustrated. And in Germany, I do live in Germany now, so I thought I will buy it. It actually looks quite nice, but this again, it's a puzzle that it's a couple of hours or maybe less. This one I bought because this is also a new brand for me, Ibu. Ah, they don't have this folly around, they do have only this one. Uh, it's probably better for um, environmental reasons. This one is around. Um, jigsaw puzzle. I have done around jigsaw puzzle. It's actually on the on the um, channel, on the time lapse. This one was an uh, art painting. This one is uh, from fishes and boats, and I liked it. I said this was uh, actually a little bit more expensive than the others, but I said it's a new company. I have to buy it for me and for for you also. Uh, this one I have upside down. This one is also a map, the Thames Valley, or to the Thames Valley. Uh, yeah, it looks like a really interesting how the Thames goes uh, like a snake uh, in England. Old Windsor, Dutchet, Shepperton. Yeah, you do learn a little bit of geography as you do these puzzles. This one is the receipt, probably. Yes, this is not the part interesting. Some more packaging stuff. Also, let's put him away. Oh, and now we will go to the bigger boxes. Not bigger puzzles necessarily, but bigger boxes. Ah, this one. Uh, this one came out with the packaging. I, I fell in love as, as I saw this. I really love trains. I have many puzzles that are uh, train, trains themed, so to say. Uh, this one is called the Viaduct from Falcon Company. And they have um, many beautiful images. They are kind of illustrated, their images, that is. The quality, I, I remember, was actually very good. I do recommend them. Uh, did I buy this? I'm not sure. I don't remember this. Well, I have to check. <laughs> I have to check again. But either way, it's a, a map of Europe. I did. I did make this. Um, Order quite some time ago, so I'm not kind of remember it. Uh, it's the map of Europe with the people. So let's put this also aside. Ah, this one I found it funny. Flying is a child's thing. Something like this was the name. So you'd see a propeller and a barrel. Uh, homemade, so to say, flying machine. I do believe it would be quite funny and interesting to make. Eurographics. I have done some Eurographic puzzles. Uh, 
they are worth a try. Anatolian, uh, this one is San Francisco. Yeah, 1,500 pieces. Anatolian, I have bought some, but I have not yet done any of them. They're a brand from Turkey. They are I'm a little heavier than the other ones. Maybe the cupboard is thicker or something. We will see when we make them. Ah, this one I like. Uh, this one was the... This one is spring. There are all the four seasons. The winter is not yet here because um, they didn't have it uh, to deliver it in, um, immediately, but I, I have already ordered it. It will come some time. Uh, I like this. It's like... How can I describe this? It's like a... Not a painting, it's like a poster or something, a quite high quality poster or so. Uh, here's uh, it's also a mini poster included. Uh, it's at Cobble Hill. Yeah, Cobble Hill. Cobble Hill, Cobble Hill. The country, the country diary and of, of an Edwender lady. Let's see if we find it again the, the other two. Yeah, actually I found one of them. I do believe they made some mistakes in the delivery. Uh, I will contact them and see if they can, if we can come to an agreement or something. Uh, this is autumn, spring, autumn. Uh, it's quite the same image, but probably with another type of birds, another seeds, uh, here are some berries, some mushrooms, uh, is this the same one? Ah oh, no, this is not the same one, it's the same uh, type of image, I do remember, this is got an amnabulous. Uh, Help is on the way, something like this. It's quite similar with the flying as a child things. Uh, to tell you the truth, this is the first time I had to get something a little different than what I ordered. But I have to check the order again because I did make it some time ago. This is uh, actually a Christmas theme. I was quite interested in this theme, it was an, on an offer. <laughs> I was not uh, sure that I put, it, I put it on the card, but I probably did. Something different, uh, I have not tried some something like this before. And now, this one I thought it was quite funny to make, high heels. It's, uh, I, I do not believe I have a puzzle that has to do with uh, fashion, but now I do. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah, they were, they are somewhat kinky, some of them, but I, they have a lot of colors, a lot of flowers. I do believe that it would be a fun puzzle to make. And uh, you know me, I have so many puzzles, uh, so I have to try something different. And now I will go to the, something um, a little bit different. This is a, a girl, you already saw. It's uh, from the same uh, brand I bought some time ago. I, you can see it on, the, on an older jigsaw puzzle hall I have. This one was, and this one. That's the last one here. Uh, these, these actually were quite intriguing and they, they, I did receive some comments about them, where did I find them and so on. And now I will show you something else, something extra. Something I bought from another place, from a discount market. This uh, is supposed to be 3D, so we will see how it will work out. The parrots, I really love the red color. This is from Clemendoni. They do have 
Let's bring them all here together. I thought that this would also be interesting in a 3D image. Let's see. This one also, a ti an, um, not a tiger, a leopard. Uh, maybe the, um, the waterfall may be very interesting with the glasses that it says that they are included inside. I am not quite sure if I make this on a video or if you can see it, but we will try them out. And the last one is a, a fluorescent. Also, it glows in the dark. This is from Dubai. Uh, it's been quite some time. I didn't have a, made a puzzle with a city or a landscape or something like this. So, quite some stuff. Did you like any of the puzzles you see? Have you bought any one of them? Would you like to make one of them? Would you like to buy one of them? Would you like uh, a specific one to see on the on a um, time lapse here on the channel? I'm always uh, happy to hear about your um, ideas and what you think about this. Because as I already said, and as I always say, uh, a jigsaw puzzle channel or a channel in general in YouTube is not what I think, because I am behind the camera and stuff and so on. It's what the community of the channel thinks. And if I can support it, then it will be better for you also. Feel free to write me in the comments and tell me all you think about the puzzles, if you like puzzles, and in general. Feel free to comment and I will try to do my best to get in contact with you. Thanks for watching, happy puzzling, and see you on the next video.